Hey, it's Aran here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to review this software called Flowlens, which helps you turn your passion into income and is basically a storefront that you can create as a creator. And they have a bunch of features and they've actually reached out to me to do a video review on my channel. It is a sponsored video and I just wanted to give a objective review on my thoughts. I have never actually logged in to this account to actually try it out. So this is a real time review to give you my thoughts, the good and the bad. So with that said, let me go ahead and create my own store and share my thoughts about the various features and the options available with this particular software. So my store is going to be called around Bukai. I'm going to click on launch my store. Looks like it's already taken. Really? Who's taken around Bukai? Let's make it Iran. Okay, Iran is yours. Good, I'll do that. Use email and password. Okay, so I'm going to enter my email address, create account. Now I need to enter my name, Iran Bukai, create account. So far, pretty good user experience. Okay, lovely, lovely little onboarding here. How to start, set up your store, create your first product, payments, and customers. So you can actually watch these videos. This is a really nice little welcome to make things a bit easier. You can see here, create the store, create a product, add payment method, add your first customer. You could see here that there is upgrade to pro. So you can have those options here. No fee, custom domain, make it customizable. Okay, let's start playing around with the software tool. So let's click on product. So create a product, free product, session, product. Okay, so let's create a coaching session. So I'm going to click here, click on edit. I can update, uh, upload a thumbnail. Let's pick this one. Just a random example, confirm. Okay, and then here I can actually customize what I want it to look like in my Flowland store. Okay, that's a nice user experience. I like that. So you can see that this doesn't look as good. This looks kind of cool. This looks kind of cool as well. Explain the value in a few sentences. Book a Zoom consultation to help you choose the best software to manage your business, let's say. Fixed price, let's say 97. Original price will be crossed out in the sale. Okay, so I can do a little sale. So let's say I do 47. So that's nice. That's a good user experience to give people an incentive to buy. Duration of the session, okay, 30 minutes is good. Now I can choose the location. So a couple of things, a couple options. Disable, handle scheduling yourself, custom, link a calendar. Customers will schedule sessions via flow links. Okay, so I can actually schedule. Okay, so I can book a calendar from inside Flowland. So let's say I'm going to say, okay, I'm only going to do the calls on Friday and I'm going to do the calls between 12.30 and 4.30 PM. Thanks for your purchase. Looking forward to our call. Okay, that's good. Choose location. Okay, so I could do Zoom. Insert your own link. Okay, so now I got to go to Zoom to create a link. Interesting. Not the best user experience. I mean, I. I get it. It needs to be created for the future. I wonder if there is integration with Zoom. So let's click on, let's just save this particular product so we don't lose it. Okay, and you can see that it says public. Okay, that's good. Copy link. So what happens when it's copied, when I copy the link? Myflowlands.com forward slash Iran. Okay, that's good. I can choose a time. Product coming soon. Why does it say product coming soon? I guess because it's not integrated. Okay, now let's look at integrations quickly to see if there's a way to integrate Zoom and all that. So custom domains is not available yet. Default currency, that's all good. Payments, I got to connect Stripe. Okay, okay, that's why it's not letting me Stripe. Let's see how easy it is to connect Stripe. Okay, connecting Stripe is pretty straightforward. I don't really want to connect my account at this point, but it seems to be um, pretty straightforward. You just got to go through the steps. Advance, connect to my Google Calendar, that's good. New location. Ah, okay, so this is where I will include Zoom links and all that stuff. Okay, so I can create a Zoom link, yeah. Okay, Zoom link, all that, all that good, all that good stuff is all doable. Google Meet, yeah, that's good. Go back to Flowlands, paste it here, click on save, and you've got a location. So you can create different locations. And also you can actually customize it. So you can say Google Meet uh, free consult, for example, or paid consult, let's say. Okay, that's good. Uh, and then you can collect your Google Calendar so everything syncs, which is great. Love that. Now, I'm assuming that the reason this is actually not ready to go is because um, I cannot, I don't have the payment info yet. Okay, so this will be public and this will be private. So it's only going to be accessible through the link. This is going to be public on my page. If I want to update, upgrade, 
I need, if I want to edit that, I need to upgrade. And then at some point, they're going to let me be able to add additional information. Okay, that's good. This is the flow lens link. Ah, this is the this one. Okay, so they're giving me an option on how to create, how to customize that. Okay, that's nice. Start for free. Okay, yeah. Interesting. Hmm. I think this is not a good user experience for them because I'm on a free plan and I'm going to hide it. So they probably want to fix that. Okay, let's look at the store. Okay, so this is now the store. That's good. I like that. Let's edit that, upload my picture. Okay, confirm, save. Pretty good user experience on that. I can add social media. Okay, that's good. So I can add Instagram and all these options. Love that. This is a really good user experience. So let's grab Instagram. And let's add YouTube. YouTube and let's add Facebook. Yeah, it's a nice user experience. I like that. They've got other options, LinkedIn, Medium, Threads, WhatsApp, Telegram, Slack, email, other. Okay, let's add my blog, for example. Okay, that's good. Free digital products. Okay, I can reorder. Oh, I see. Then they let me reorder. That's good. So I can't actually move it until I click on reorder. That's cool. I like that. And if I want to edit any of these, okay, good. So this is the, because I'm not connected the payment, it's not going to work yet. Landing page. Uh, okay. Let's click on lead magnets. Get your affiliate marketing guide, let's say. Okay, I can up okay, so I can upload the file. That's good. I like that. Let's grab something. Okay, that's a PDF. Okay, so let's change that. Launching a membership case study, let's say. This presentation will walk you through my launch of 11K in seven days using System.io. Oh, you, yeah, yeah, okay, that's good. Thanks for downloading. Please let me know if you have any questions. Email me, contact at aroundbukai.com. Okay, that's good. Like that. Continue. Make it public. I can't collect more info. Why is there no info here? And...
Okay, so now contacts, that's good. Calendar, okay, that's where I can customize things and I can collect my calendar, I love that, that's really good. I can also create a new session, I guess. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, that's good, very nice. Any sales come through here. And this is my referral link. And this is important to also know how much you're actually gonna earn. Yeah, that's cool. Lovely. Now let me understand their pricing quickly. Okay, I'm gonna stop the tele TV. So the other thing I wanted to pay, uh, another thing I want to draw your attention to is you see if it under my store, if you go to design, you'll be able to choose how you want the style of your store to be as well, which is kind of cool. Nice little user experience to make it kind of easy, which is great. There's also an option to add gradient and they give you some suggestions, which is nice. Um, you can see on the buttons on the cards, you can choose if you want it to be rounded or straight, soft, soft shadow like so. The buttons, you can choose how you want those as well. And it automatically actually customizes. You can choose your font as well, which is really nice. Uh, and all, all that's actually a really, really good user experience. I really like that, how they've got that set up. So that's really nice. Um, yeah, really nice how they've got it. Rounded pill, square, button color. Don't want to make this orange. Like so. Save. Okay, that's good. Pill. Hard shadow, okay, yeah. The button doesn't allow shadows. Okay, so it's a Montserrat minus Poppins. That's really good. Obviously, that's the end of their options, which is fine. That's, there's nothing wrong with that. The cards, you can choose how you want the cards to be, which is nice. On the gradients, Okay, you can still choose how you want it to be, which is great. Like so, okay, that's good. Very nice. You can also do solid color. We'll go with gradient, gradient's nice. And then this part, what does this do? Oh, okay, this is the actual Customization, it actually gives you templates to pick from. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, that's good. And this is your store URL. Good user experience, lovely. Schedule now, start for free. Okay, so now you can actually uh, also sequence those separately. So on my storefront, you can click on reorder and you can choose to reorder it like so, which is great. And what are these options? Oh, I can add a description. Okay. Uh, let's say I'll call myself entrepreneur. There you go. Something like that. Perfect. That's nice. And I can add a video. That's cool. Okay. They say vertical video for best user. Okay. That's good. So I can add a video. I won't get paid because it's no, I don't add payment plan. And this is edit mode. That's good. It's good to know. Save. And that's good. Awesome. So let me give you a quick recap on my thoughts about this particular software. So essentially what Flowlands has 
is the ability to create a simple storefront where you can actually have a calendar for people to book a call with you. You can actually accept payments once you connect your Stripe. So if you don't have Stripe in your country, you won't be able to actually use Florence to accept payments. You need to be aware of that. You also have the ability to basically build an email list and you have people download a freebie or something like that. But what is missing is there is no email marketing feature in Flowland. So that's something that you're going to need to use a different platform if you're going to want to have email marketing. So this is something that you need to pay attention to because to me, that's a big downside. Now, they may have that in the roadmap to create. If this is something you want to know or you're interested in that feature, comment the word email marketing. And I'm sure that the Flowlands team will keep an eye on this video and be able to take that into account. So I definitely recommend um, you know, obviously you're going to need the software for your email marketing. There's no real two ways about it. If you want an online business, you need to have email marketing. So that's something that is missing. I think their Zoom integration, Google Meet integration is kind of average. It's not bad, to be honest. Like you just have to grab the URL, but you can't directly integrate. Meaning when somebody books a call with you, there's not going to be an automated Zoom link created or a Google Meet. So you have to create the link elsewhere and then come back. It's fine. You just need to be aware of the workaround. Um, the affiliate program is, uh, you know, fairly generous. I think it's kind of standard. I think it's 20% uh, commission, a little bit on the low side, but 20% is great. No worries at all. Uh, you know, and this is really good for beginner friendly type customers. So if you're brand new to the online world, if you're uh, an influencer, if you're a personal trainer, you know, you can definitely set things up. There's a ways to uh, create invoices. You could do bulk sessions. So I think for coaches, it's actually kind of good. But you just need to be aware there is no email marketing included. So that aspect, hopefully, they will include that at some point in the future or have some sort of a, of a workaround. Uh, if you're just getting started in the online world, I think this is a great little solution. And definitely, um, you know, it's, it's very, very newbie friendly. And it will allow you to not get overwhelmed with, you know, creating an entire funnel or anything like that. So yeah, from that perspective, I think it's a good option. If you want to check it out, use my affiliate link, go to a run.link forward slash Flowlands. I will include that in the description. And that's about it. Hope you get value from this particular walkthrough. If you've got another tutorial you want me to do, another uh, software review, please let me know. Leave a comment below with the name of the software you'd like me to review. And hope you get value from this video. Thanks a lot. I'll speak to you soon. Cheers.